Hey guys, gals and non-binary pals. Uh, I was just diagnosed with ADHD like a week ago, and I've got some questions. Well, hello there. I got your tag, and congrats on your recent diagnosis. Welcome to the Squirrel Gang. What kind of question have you got for me? My psychologist is like, maybe you can take meds. I don't know that I want to take meds. I don't know what the meds do. Does this help? Does this change who you are? Does it, does it take away these good things? All right, I actually get to ask that one a lot, so let's talk about it. Standard disclaimer, I am not a doctor, I am not a professional. And even if I was, you should not be taking medical advice from some stranger on the internet. I think that goes back to one of those kindergarten sandbox rules. I digress. When it comes to any kind of a medication for ADHD, I am always going to be one that says it's a personal choice. Some people feel like they have the coping strategies and the methods that they need already in place. And that's fine. If that works for you, great. Run with it. But some people don't have that. And that's where things like medication may be an option. Now that being said, it should never be viewed as some kind of a magic wand or a cure. It's not. It should be viewed for what it is, another tool in our toolbox. The entire purpose when it comes to medication for ADHD is to improve systems of attention. It's supposed to help you keep your focus. In a lot of cases, it helps quiet the mind so that your brain's not running rampant all over the damn place and you can actually focus on the tasks that you need to. Do the medications change you? No, they shouldn't. Not if you're on the proper med and the proper dose. So if you feel like a zombie or if you feel like it has changed you in a negative way, Talk to your doctor, change the medication, or change the dosage. What it should not be doing is stifling your creativity. As an artist myself, that's a chief concern. I need to ensure that the medication I am on doesn't stifle my creativity. I'm an artist, I'm a musician, I'm a content creator. So again, medication? Personal choice. Do you feel like the coping methods and strategies you have in place are sufficient? Do you feel like you need something to help you maintain focus? That decision is entirely up to you. And regardless what you see on the internet, nobody should make that choice for you. But thank you for your question, and I wish you the best of luck. Let me know how it goes.